We are currently standing on C-2013A1, better known as Comet Siding Spring. The date is October 19th, 2014, and you are holding your breath praying you don't hit the big red thing coming at you or the smaller but still enormous things around it. Over the horizon, the red planet comes into view already on your doorstep. You are watching the close approach of Comet Siding Spring to Mars, and from here, you maintain visibility as you exhale, sure now that the planet has been missed and you are off on another lonely adventure. Sitting night side on the red planet will provide easy visibility, with the comet's close approach and speedy flyby overcoming the rotational perspective of the planet, and the show is over quickly. Over the horizon, you have extended visibility, but you are competing with the sun peaking out at negative 7.8 magnitude brightness, which is darn bright. The close approach is 86,000 miles, which is long if you're planning a hike, but virtually nothing in space terms. Let's take a step back. The comet is coming in not from far out through the planets, but mostly south of the orbital planes of the planets. This comet has spent a very long time south of the solar system. Its approach will be swift, along with its shift from south of the planetary orbits to the north. eighty six thousand miles there is even uncertainty to the comet's path that may bring the comet and mars even closer than that however the experts are highly confident that the two will not collide nor will the comet strike any of the moons of mars by fall the comet will be visible for most of the world we're looking in the northern hemisphere here from mid-latitude by october the show will have definitely begun the best amateur astronomers on Earth are already preparing to be the one to get the best photos on approach. The comet flies by Mars, and there is a small chance that the coma may be large enough to interact with the planet or the moons. During that time, the Mobile Observatory will be in Tennessee, and between now and then we will seek to find the best locations to set up shop and watch the show. As we are mobile, we may even be able to avoid cloud cover. Until then, all we can do is pretend and wait. Put it on your calendar now, folks. October 19th, 2014. The Red Planet Dances with the Comet. We'll be watching, and we hope you'll join us.